Hello and welcome to my channel. Today I'm doing a spirit message for a sign of Capricorn, and keep in mind that this will not resonate for every Capricorn. If you'd like a personal reading, that's going to be the first link in the description down below. Alright, and while we're talking about the description, you'll find a bunch of other things there, like my website, my Etsy shop, which you should definitely check out, and different social media platforms. I'm on even Twitch and Patreon, which, hey, we're going to be on Twitch every Sunday, so... Definitely stop by, check all this stuff out, you know. And if you like donating to the channel, feel free to do so. Okay, so, I do appreciate your donations here. On the bottom of the deck of what's currently happening, we have the Three of Swords. Three of Swords tells me that you had a backstabber here. Okay, someone who stabbed you in the back, someone who hurt you here. Even in this Three of Swords, what do you see here? Alright, so that could have already happened, or it's currently happening, or something like that. You have the Ten of Swords, the Page of Wands, the Two of Wands, the Four of Wands with the Empress Capricorn. I don't really see this affecting you a whole lot, so you did have a person like this here. Alright, feels like you let that go, that um, Ten of Swords. Okay. But it feels like that doesn't really affect you a whole lot here. If not, it, it just made you better almost here because you're like showing up as the Empress. You're showing up in a good spot, okay? It doesn't really feel like it affected your emotions a whole lot. I also feel like if you sell things, that's going to be good for you. I see a lot of people being interested in what you're selling. I just see you being in this good sort of vibe, Capricorn. I see you being in the Empress mode, okay? So I don't really think that this person affected you a whole lot. On the bottom of the deck of what's coming towards you, we have the Ten of Wands. So Capricorn, another interesting thing about you, I see you kind of, like, worrying if you have enough, but I see you being fine. Okay? We have the Nine of Wands. We have the King of Cups, which is water. The Ace of Wands, Ten of Pentacles, Strength card, which is Leo. So I see that there could be a water sign with Leo placements coming towards you. You could also have Leo placements, but I feel like this person may have Leo placements. Um, I see them coming towards you, Capricorn, wanting commitment with you. Ten of Pentacles is what they're wanting. Alright, I also see you setting up boundaries. Feels like you're very much in your own power here, Capricorn. Strength card, Nine of Wands, the Empress. Alright, I also feel like money's going to be good for you. Home life, all that stuff. Messages and Vice Read number 40 with Sorceress of Light. So that is you, Capricorn. You're the Sorceress of Light. Alright, and while you're being this, all right, you're at that higher vibration. Nothing is going to bring you down. We have Transformation, which definitely does feel like that. Like you are going through this Transformation. Ten of Swords with that butterfly. Butterflies represent Transformation. We have number 11, the Moonstone Star. Passion. I'm entering a portal of euphoric love. This feels like love that you're having with this water sign that's coming towards you. Alright, one of you. Went through a portal here with them. Now they're coming in. Moonstone. Okay, I also have Moonstone on my website. We have number 16 with Gal Galia, the Angel of Power. Number 12, So Kid Hosey, the Angel of Balance. And these two angels can be with you throughout December here. And number 10 with Assurance. Number 5 with Attachment. Alright, so this is telling you that things are going to be okay. Things are going to work out for you. I honestly see that. Um, also, attachment. Can be like memories of that person who hurt you, or stabbed you in the back, or like something that you still need to cut the cords to. Okay. We have number 27, Sisters of the Star Blossoms. This is the wrong book. <laughs> oh my god. It's like, why is it not there? It is good to remember that whilst we each take our own unique journey back into divine bliss and truth, we have plenty of friends that love us unconditionally and wish to help us find the way back home with the least suffering and greatest joy. 
When we allow ourselves to be helped, we help others too. It is a spiral of support and love that is wishing to connect with more so with you now. Look at this. Capricorn, this is talking about group energy. You see, group energy is powerful. You understand? It's talking about, yeah, you can do good things on your own, and I do want you to have that mindset. But it's also, you know, I feel like this water sign wanting to come in, wanting to offer you commitment here. That can be a good thing, so try not to, I don't know, con I guess, consider it Capricorn. I'll see a lot of people just in general wanting to work with you, wanting to collaborate. Um, so, that is all I have for you. And like I said, first link in the description down below for a personal reading. And if you want to see more content, don't forget to like, subscribe. Bye guys.